hello and hi everybody welcome back to another one of this time i'm back at it with another one from sml theory and this one is sml fnaf 5 coming soon so we all know that sml fnaf sister location is the next big video that's gonna be released within the next couple of weeks logan has mentioned before that the beginning of march around there will be more likely the the time period where five nights at freddy's sister location will be released and i have been seeing some leaks i have been seeing videos on uh zach and valerie's tiktok and then creating the the costumes for the video they're looking crazy as hell i'm very excited uh to see how the video turns out once they actually start uh recording the video and it's gonna be a, a big video and i'm really really excited to see it and the day is coming closer like march is almost here and we're about to see Five Nights at Freddy's sister location come to life soon. So really excited for it. So with that being said, if you haven't yet subscribed to Smoke Theory, then be sure to go subscribe. The link to the original is in the description. So with that being said, let's get into this. SML movie Five Nights at Freddy's 5 is finally coming soon. The last one that we got, SML Five Nights at Freddy's 4, was uploaded almost two months ago. And even that one we had to wait a whole month for. But with Sister Location being one of the most complex games in the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise, Logan had to take an insane amount of time perfecting the costumes and sets. Until now, we recently got a video from Logan on his vlog channel saying that we're we're finally about to get SML Movie Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location. And immediately in the video, he says that they just finished Jeffy Ball Z and then says that Sister Location will come out in the first week of March. Excellent. I know I promised it like a week or two ago, but with the Super Bowl, I was so busy. So this Sunday, Jeffy Ball Z, the next part will be uploaded on Sunday, and uh, which is in two days. And then... The next update I want to give you guys is the Five Nights at Freddy's sister location video. So they're working on the costumes. I still think we're pushing for maybe the first week of March. So we're probably about two weeks away before sister location is going to be filmed mm -hmm. and uploaded. And since Logan will only upload the Five Nights at Freddy's videos on weekends, that means we could either get the video on March 1st or 3rd, not the 2nd, because Logan doesn't upload on Saturdays, or what's Sometimes. more likely is that we'll get the video on either the 8th or the 10th. But what was the cause of this insanely long wait, and which day will it actually be? Will it be the 1st or 3rd, or will we have to wait? a bit longer for the 8th or 10th. Well, we can actually figure this out by looking at both what Logan said in the vlog as well as looking at Zach's TikTok as he's the one making the costumes with his wife, Valerie. And just from what I've seen, I think they've been doing an amazing job. Mm -hmm. So the we know with the Sister crazy. Location game, there are multiple locations. And we know with SML's first three FNAF videos, they made a set and it was... Oh, you <laughs> fucking bitch. I don't give a shit really good. But for the fourth video, they just used the house that they used as the Huckerdoo's house, which made sense because they didn't need anything too crazy. But for the fifth video, they have to go yeah, all they have to out. Go all and out. I mean all out because there are so many different locations, which I don't think we'll see all of them, but we'll definitely see a few and that takes so much time to make. But that's not the only thing that takes forever. One thing you didn't know is that the costumes are getting super upgraded. The costumes that we've had for the last few videos videos have been really well made and especially detailed in the fourth video mm -hmm. but if you look at the ones that they're making for the fifth episode we can really see the effort if we yeah. go to zach's tiktok we can see that they've been working on the fun time mm -hmm. animatronics I've been for seeing quite these a while now but when i say the costumes are getting super upgraded i mean mm -hmm. it. zach they're posted definitely. a video showing off the new fun time freddy suit and if you look at the head it literally springs open mm -hmm. and can then be reshut using magnets and a Spring. That's crazy. It's got these uh, magnets in here and screws to hold it. And then uh, I created like a spring mechanism. Which goes to show that's why we've been waiting so long and might mean that we'll have to wait a bit longer just because the suits are such high quality. But just a week ago, they already finished an entire suit. We see that they made another TikTok where they tried on the suit for Funtime Freddy and showed off all of the design and mechanism for the face. Mm -hmm. Look at that. I got no way to pop you Look at that. Gonna take you along for the ride and that's how it snaps back together we still got to do the bottom jaw um 
and paint everything, put it all together. But uh, yeah, and there's all the pieces, the legs and arms and feet and stuff. So all that's just got to be painted. We'll be ready to go. And show that they're almost done with the bond Oh yeah, bond the bond bond, bond, bond You can see him holding it in his hand. They also apparently made new gloves for better mobility for the actors who are going to be playing in the characters, which means that they're going to be doing a lot more with the animatronics in this video, which could be a good thing, oh, but yeah. who knows, it could be a bad thing. And if they're already finished with one animatronic, this means that they must be close to finishing the others, right? Well, this may or may not be true. About a week after this video, they then started showing the beginnings of Funtime Foxy, mm. Ballora, and Baby. And we can see that Funtime Foxy is looking good. However, yeah, yeah. he's missing his entire lower jaw because they haven't even gone to that part yeah, yet. Yeah, they just got started on his head. These little wires that are in here, these are little fish tape, but they, they kind of spring to hold it open. And then... All these magnets hold it together, and there's still some little adjustments on some of these screws, like this one needs to be flattened out. But, uh, yeah, it's Together. But they did already start making the spring mechanics for opening his face, but it's when we see Ballora and Baby, I start to get a bit worried because they're literally just faces right now. Yeah. They have to make the entire suit in about 10 days if they really want to upload on March yeah, 1st or that 3rd, looks crazy. which is then again leaning me towards them uploading later on the 8th or 10th. Could be. And with this, I also have a prediction. It seems that with all of these new suits and all of the new sets that they're making, the that video that we're gonna get might be 20 or even 30 minutes long. Mm. It would only make sense since they can have many different scenes with each character. Yeah, or probably could be second week of March. Exploring sister location as well. They might have more characters work there, like in the third episode where Brooklyn guy Junior Joseph and Cody were working there all at once. It allowed for more plot point. Yeah, this place burned down literally last night. And I just tried to fix it up as best I can. But there used to be these animatronics that would run around and try to eat you, but they all burned up. Well, there's actually one left. Here, I'll show you. So this is the stage. Wait, why is the camera so bad? Oh, they're just shitty in this one. Well, why don't you get new cameras? I'm not going to spend hundreds of dollars on good cameras. I only charge you kids $10 each. And although they did slowly kill off Cody and Joseph with more characters, they could do a lot more and extend the videos. Plus, Logan has been talking about making more long videos like Jeffy's 18th and 19th birthday more often. So this would really be a perfect opportunity. Mm -hmm. And since the FNAF videos always get the most views, if they do make the video really really long, then it will probably get even more views from having a lot of watch yeah. time from fans. Okay. Probably. Okay, let's see. There's literally nothing. Why would they lie to us? Guys, quit screwing around. Guys, if you were embarrassed, we caught you playing peepees in the blanket. It's fine. We were going to play it too. Yeah, we just needed to borrow the blanket. No, Freddy would really come up the stairs. And could make Logan and SML a lot more money, but it's probably unlikely. Chair chomper. For fuck's sake, dude. Oh my god, a 15 second non skippable ad, you son of a bitch. Fuck off. Seem to rush the FNAF videos once it reaches the end, like how they killed off all the animatronics in two minutes at the end of the first episode. <laughs> yeah, let's get 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 I'm kind of worried about is that we haven't seen any of the sets for sister location and I'm starting to think maybe it's not Zach or Valerie who are working on them which can make sense because they'd be making only the costumes but mm -hmm. with the sets who's going to be making yeah, who's gonna, those who's gonna maybe set them they up? have some other people but I don't think Logan and the SML crew would build it themselves as it would take way too much time away from the three videos that they already make every single week which makes me think we might just have normal buildings or rooms for the video like in the fourth episode they just used timmy's house oh, rascal. all right timmy let's get in this closet Ooh, me first <laughs> did you just hear them scream yeah i did junior do you want to go check it out not really okay i'll go check it out if you hear me scream you call the cops okay uh guys 
rather than building a set for the exact same room. So in the fifth episode, they might just take some normal rooms and make them look somewhat like the rooms in the game. Mm -hmm. For example, if a room has a desk in it, they would just have a desk. Same thing goes for windows, doors, or anything else that they will absolutely need. But the game mechanics, they literally have to make sets for. Like in yeah. the third episode, they made a laptop just like you would use it in the game. So in the fifth episode, they would at least need those, which in my opinion, I think the video could turn out okay, but it would still be really cool if they built the full sets, which were detailed just like the game, which maybe means we'd have to wait until the 8th or 10th. Yeah, that does the make sense. The 8th or 10th. But we don't want them to rush it or ruin it, so I'm fine with that. But let me know when you think FNAF 5 is going to release down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and click on this video here. Yeah, with like, with like the prog the, the progression or the progress of Zack and Valerie making the costumes. They just got started with Ballora and Baby and Foxy as well. And we're getting very really close to March. We're really getting close to March. Uh, next weekend is the, the first weekend of March. And then the next weekend after that will be 8th and 10th. I feel like, as it's looking right now, it could release on the 8th or 10th of March. If it if they decide to fill, record, upload it on Friday or Sunday, but recently, but like on all the videos we've seen, I keep getting interrupted every single fucking second. So I'm gonna end the video right there. So if you enjoyed this, then be sure to give this video a like. If you haven't yet, subscribe. And be sure to do this right now and turn on notifications to be notified for any video that I upload. And I'll catch you guys later in the next one whenever I start doing that. So hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. So take care.